The I2C bus is the most popular serial bus for connecting any number of peripherals to a control microprocessor. Almost every embedded controller on the market today includes an I2C connection, and software is readily available to manage that bus, which has propelled its popularity. The I2C bus is a two-wire, open-drain configuration with a clock and data line. All the peripherals are connected in parallel to the bus making board layout easily while utilizing a minimum number of pins for the bus connection. The I2C protocol is similarly simple. It consists of a number of 8-bit words and a handshake signal to acknowledge the correct receipt of data. The protocol sends out an address byte and a read-write bit to select which peripheral the micro wishes to communicate with. This means only 7 bits are available for addressing peripherals on the bus or a maximum of 127 different addresses. If a designer wants to use two identical peripherals on the same bus, there will be an address conflict since both I2C addresses are exactly the same. One solution is to make a different chip with a different I2C address. However, this is wasteful and too much work. It enlarges the bill of material or bomb costs and just isn't practical. The way NXP has solved this problem is with two or three pins dedicated to externally programming the I2C address by connecting them to the power supply or ground. With three pins, one can have eight different addresses. Pins, of course, are valuable. So NXP has devised a novel way to increase the number of I2C addresses with the same number of pins or by minimizing the number of pins needed for the same number of addresses. The PCT2075 is an example of this solution. It recognizes power and ground on the address pins, but also a no connect. For example, using the traditional method, three pins yield eight addresses. Using this new scheme, three pins generate 27 addresses. NXP, the inventor of the I2C bus, continues innovating with solutions that solve the everyday problems you face. Learn more at tempsensors.interfacechips.com.